infertility really is an infertility that you you know you obviously when 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 ovulation doesn't happen in in a timely manner your cycles become prolonged so you would you would experience as as a woman you would uh, experience very long cycles you would have like you know a, a cycle from 30 days and upwards you know 30 days 40 days 50 days even sometimes skip a month so extremely long and irregular irregular cycles as a result of that you know you um you also experience usually um, extra hair growth, so you have a condition that we call hirsutism, which can present itself with facial hair, with hair growth around the, the, the nipples, in the decollete, on the back, so you have extra um, body and facial hair, you have usually very oily skin, you, you have a tendency to be, um, to be rather obese you know you have you, you're a bit more on the chubby side so it's very more, much more difficult to have your 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 weight in a, in a in a steady level you need to really struggle constantly with losing weight it's very difficult to lose weight and that's where all the um you know your great effort comes in because these ovaries they tend to all selves with a tendency towards insulin resistance so it's not only that they have delayed ovary, uh, you know, ovulation. They also have, um, you know, increased testosterone. They have a very high, high LH level on blood tests. And I think one big difference that we should also differentiate because, you know, we don't want women to be scared when they get diagnosed with polycystic ovaries because very often it creates a, a great deal of of uh, fear. You know, you you're diagnosed with polycystic ovary. And then, you know, the, the traditional approaches that they put on the pill, you suddenly controlled by synthetic hormones that you take orally every day. So the, the function and the, um, you know, the, the uh, process of ovulation, etc., that happens every month gets totally stalled. And with the use of contraceptive pill, you just take externally your, your tablet every day and then you have like a fake period in a way because you just when you stop your period you get a withdrawal bleed but of course this is not really addressing the issue of polycystic ovaries